Hello fellow traders, welcome to another episode of the series. Thank you very much for your support. I got a message from a viewer uh, to follow my trades. Of course, uh, this is the reason that I have creating this channel to help you make your own strategy. Uh, that's why I created a real account because I wanted you to uh, understand the difference as most people out there claim that can beat the market but they have no tangible evidence. Uh, this is beyond doubt. The reason that all the materials that you will find in this channel will help you grow as traders. Again, uh, this is not an easy process and I'm referring to people who just started and probably since you are watching this video, you are newbies. That's why I'm recommending to start with demo accounts and I don't want to repeat myself. Uh, my videos are not just a generic content, so every time I will try to be creative. Uh, there is no holy grail in trading. Uh, with time, you will see that all pieces will start to make sense. I will provide a video for all the patterns, but there are too many. So keep in mind that it is just a new channel, so I want you to be patient. Uh, now, uh, let's uh, dive uh, to the topic. How to trade head and shoulders. And I don't mean the shampoo, even though if you are using it, uh, you will end up with the same results. Uh, shiny hair uh, and a losing account, probably. It's bread and butter in technical analysis. Uh, you will see it many times. Uh, mentioned is something very important. It's a very strong pattern, indeed. indeed. Uh, we have the visual uh, representation, uh, representation here, uh, but don't expect uh, to find uh, something like this in a live market. Of course, we will open uh, in the real market. Uh, also, keep in mind uh, a very important factor. When you are learning something new in trading, uh, in general, when you are learning something new, you, you will uh, probably see it again and again and again, I, can, I have already uh, talked about this effect that you need to take care and pay attention. How this work? Uh, price is coming from an uptrend. Uh, they are shooting up. They are forming the left shoulder. Now the price is shoots down again. They are hitting the neck. Uh, they are moving up. They are going to the head. They are forming this little top. Rejection, the price is pulled back, goes up again, and they now form the right shoulder. Now, left and right shoulder most likely will be aligned on the same levels. Uh, again, we are talking about trading, so do not expect this to be exactly as you see. This is just a visual representation. Of course, uh, I will open the live markets and I will show you examples. Uh, this is the main idea. Uh, the price is break the neck again, and now. Uh, this is a pattern that shows uh, market reversal, um, that a big uh, change is coming. The, your trade will be a one-to-one. -one. Uh, it's a horrible risk-reward ratio, and that's why I will show you how to uh, trade it, because we are never uh, trade this pattern and only this pattern. I mean, I've said that there is no holy grail in trading. You just need to combine too many information together, and when all the pieces come together and you have this alignment, you hit the trigger. Um, what will be our target? Our trade will be the same distance from the neck to the head and should be our exit point should be somewhere here. It's exactly uh, the same distance, let's say. Uh, the opposite will come to the other side when we have the inverted pattern. Uh, the prices come from a downtrend. They are hitting the right shoulder. They are going up again. They are start forming uh, this line, the neck. Uh, again, they go down. They make the head. They shoot up. Again down. They are creating the left shoulder. Uh, right and left shoulder most likely will be aligned exactly as the previous one. And now the prices shoots up. Again, uh, the same one-to-one -one, uh, risk-reward ratio. Uh, the distance from neck to head uh, should be our distance to trade. So uh, this is exactly uh, how the theory works before uh, behind the head and shoulder pattern. These are reversal patterns. Uh, and uh, now I will open some real markets to see uh, if we can spot some of them in there. Let's go to some 
real markets uh, show taskbar let's see uh, i have spot some of them here uh, again uh, they are very messy sometimes there will be cluster clear and the pattern will emerge uh, don't don't um, give so much uh, attention uh, and i and i'll tell you why so uh, here is the price is coming down uh, they are forming uh, the left neck they are shooting up they are going down shooting up again uh, they are coming around at the same area and this means that uh, the prices will reverse to the upside of course uh, you execute your trade and most likely um, since you have a one to one risk reward ratio and you are trading uh, this distance uh, probably you would have exited at this point and you would feel lucky uh, you were just lucky, I can guarantee. It's a one-to-one -one risk reward ratio. Let's go to Australia. Now, uh, you see that the prices uh, are a bit more choppier uh, at this case. Uh, again, uh, they go down. They form uh, the left neck, which it, that's why I choose this one because it's it's a bit uh, choppy and not easy to understand. Uh, I remember there are sites that you can visit and they will automatically pop up the pattern so you don't have to worry uh, so much about it but it will help you in your trading system and I will explain why and uh, now this is a losing trade or I'm not sure if this is uh, he was lucky I think probably that she was lucky and he would win the trade um, now let's go to another I will open the UP the euro yen well, here are again uh, the significant points that you need to pay attention um, now so far uh, this is your trade uh, the prices break uh, above shooting back down the retracement in a one-to-one -one, uh, risk reward ratio uh, you most likely uh, caught this one also of course um, <laughs> you probably imagining that it's a winning strategy is not that's why i choose uh, this pattern uh, to show you and how they can uh, easily uh, mislead you uh, what is what is the logic uh, behind this pattern now uh, of course we have a significant distance so most likely the the prices will uh, retrace if we search back also for some significant uh, prices now the prices hits up uh, go down uh, they hit the same now remember uh, that's why they are working sometimes optically because we are creating imaginary lines also with the prices and that's why uh, we also make some trend lines which are seems uh, a bit ridiculous in trading and of course you don't have to take them in consideration but they can help you uh, when you want to see a channel or something uh, that's very similar now the prices shoots up they don't find any significant uh, res uh, support at this level to keep going higher. Uh, probably you're going to see that there's a double top. That's why I tell you, you have to start reading uh, the chart and combine the information after information. And this is the hardest part in trading. And the prices shoot down again. They try to climb, but they cannot pass uh, the previous uh, support resistance now because we won't search back uh, in the past so instead of this to stand as a support and the prices shoots up what is happening the prices uh, shoots down eventually this price range uh, is not uh, let's say so uh, comfortable uh, for the buyers because the sellers are many many more and that's how uh, eventually the prices shoots down uh, of course uh, when you are changing time frames everything will disappear everything will look different uh, you need to mark your area that you want to trade we say that we can we recognize uh, a trend line uh, we're gonna go uh, to the direction of the trend and this is uh, the main idea um, is just a pattern it's very known uh, you also uh, must keep 
keep this pattern uh, in your mind uh, because as I have explained many times uh, most of the traders uh, are looking uh, for the same information for the same things of course this makes them repeat the pattern again and again that's why we have 95 percent losers I do not disagree with that argument but um, in this case uh, when you are uh, mentioning that there is a head and shoulders pattern most likely you should take it in consideration in your trade it's okay if you want to go to the opposite direction this won't change uh, anything uh, you must be strong and uh, you must follow your trade uh, we have said that in all, all of our videos test it uh, before using the real money always uh, use a demo account I hope you enjoy the video uh, I try to make it uh, I didn't uh, I try to keep it tight and to show you exactly the information that you're gonna need uh, as I said and I will always keep saying this is just a signal that you, it will help you uh, to your trades do not take it in consideration because uh, the negative of this is the horrible risk reward ratio I mean it's a one-to-one -one. Um, in my opinion in my perspective I do not trade the head and shoulder pattern of course I take it in consideration like many other traders when uh, we see it uh, happening uh, the market moves in waves so the best way is just to try to follow and keep in that wave in that uh, trend I hope you enjoy the video trade safe and I hope I'll see you in the future.